If you are looking to get the Rolex Submariner experience, but only looking to spend $500, then this is a watch that you seriously need to check out. You might think that it's impossible to even get close to the Submariner on such a tight budget, but this micro brand dive watch comes pretty damn close. So let's take a look. Rolex Submariner is one of, if not the, most iconic watches in the world. I don't know about you though, but I don't have a spare 10 grand laying around to buy one. Thankfully, with this new watch by Wise, it is indeed possible to get a Submariner-like experience for a fraction of the cost, 5% of the price to be exact. You could indeed buy 20 of these watches for the price of a single Submariner. Now, that's all well and good, but come on, it's a Rolex. There's no way that this watch even comes close to the Submariner, right? Well, I think you'll be surprised. Now, there's a few reasons why I believe this to be the ultimate budget Submariner alternative. So, allow me to explain. Rolex is famous for using a different grade of steel than pretty much every other watch manufacturer. The industry standard is 316L, as I'm sure you all already know. But Rolex uses 904L for their oyster cases instead. Is this just Rolex trying to be different, or is this steel actually better? Well, research shows that 904L steel is more corrosion resistant than 316L. Also, it's possible to achieve a higher polish with 904L. Basically, it makes their watches a little bit shinier. And because 316L is the industry standard, it's a much cheaper steel to work with. Around 3% cheaper, in fact. It's said that 904L needs special machines and processes to be used in manufacturing watch components. And the reason why I tell you this is because this watch from Wise is actually made from 904L steel. And you simply won't find many watches under a grand that are made with this grade of steel. So the Adamascus shares the same type of steel as the Rolex Submariner. The comparisons don't just stop at the steel, however. Just like the Submariner, this Wise shares a very similar spec sheet to the Rolex Superstar. For starters, we have a ceramic bezel with white markings. Covering the dial is a sapphire crystal, albeit domed, and thanks to the screw down crown and case back, we have a dive capable 200 meters of water resistance. Interestingly though, we do see the use of a display case back, which is actually made from sapphire. So this watch is indeed a sapphire sandwich. Yes, the Rolex does have a higher water resistance at 300 meters, but when all you do is paddle in a pool on holiday, what's the bloody difference? I would say that the sizing is also what makes the Submariner so popular, with the Oyster case being a universal fit across almost any wrist size. And Wise have adapted a similar sort of philosophy. Just like the Submariner, the Wise Adamascus comes in with a 41 millimeter case diameter. But thanks to the relative relatively compact 47mm lug to lug, it should fit pretty much any size wrist. One place the Adamascus actually trumps the Submariner is in case thickness, coming in at just 11.5mm, which quite honestly is breathtaking for an affordable 200m dive watch. This however is down to the choice of movement. Wise decided to use the Myota 9015. The movement features some finishing, and Wise has used a custom rotor. It's not visual perfection or anything, but I have seen a lot worse looking movements, that's for sure. This Japanese movement beats at 28,800 vibrations per hour and has a power reserve of roughly 42 hours. The six o'clock date is hidden so well within the indices that some of you may not have even noticed it, which I am a big fan of. The biggest benefit to this movement, aside from the nice eight ticks per second, is the super thin construction, allowing watches like this Adamascus to be super thin. Therefore, this watch wears incredibly well for a 41 millimeter watch. My personal preference is usually around the 30 38mm mark, but with the compact lug to lug and case thickness taken into account, the watch is incredibly comfortable. It easily slides under every sleeve, and honestly, sometimes I forget I'm even wearing it, which can't be said for a lot of other dive watches. Some of you may be thinking that this watch doesn't look enough like a Submariner to be considered a true alternative, but for me, that's the best part. Sure, you could go and buy a Submariner knockoff from AliExpress, but where's the fun in that? It's so much more fun, in my opinion, to have a 
watch that has its own DNA. Yes, this Adamascus clearly borrows design elements from other watches, but it combines them in a way that makes this watch more unique. My personal favourite element is the dial. What can sometimes look like a flat black surface completely morphs in different lighting conditions. This dial features a genuine 3D carbon-like finish, which will change personality throughout the day depending on the direction of light. And if the full black look is a little bit boring for you, don't worry. I advise you to check out all of the other colour options with this AD8 model. They will absolutely have one that suits your style. But of course, for that ultimate Submariner-esque experience, I think that the black one works the best. The loom on this watch ain't half bad either, with the hands, indices and bezel all featuring a generous amount of BGW9, which actually ones up the Submariner in terms of the fully loomed bezel. The indices themselves are multifaceted, with different sides shining depending on the direction of light. The hour hand has a weird paddle construction. I don't know exactly what to call this style of hour hand, so I suppose we'll just call it weird, but definitely in the good way. It helps this watch be even more unique. Speaking of, this bezel is one of the best that I've experienced. Ooh, how good's that? That's just sexy. This bezel features zero back play and zero wobble. Just like the rest of the watch, it feels extremely well put together. The case features a completely polished finish, which I'm sure Wise has done to accentuate that 904L steel. The polishing has been executed to an extremely high standard, and I really can't see any flaws. Some of you may have noticed that I've only shown you the watch on a strap. Well, Wise are currently producing a version of this watch that you can pre-order that comes with the bracelet. And yes, it does come with an on-the-fly adjustment clasp. And surprisingly, it's only $20 more than the strap version. Wise do ship this version with two straps though, one vintage style leather and one FKM rubber. Both suit the style of the watch tremendously well and are excellent quality. Basically one strap for getting wet and one strap for looking super cool. Now, no $500 watch is perfect. Hell, even the eight grand Submariner isn't. So let me run you through a few things that I didn't like about this watch for a balanced review. Firstly, although the bezel is absolutely solid, it's is a little stiff to operate. I'm guessing that this will ease a bit with more use, but it's something to consider nonetheless. Why state that they use anti-reflective treatment on the crystal, which I don't doubt but it's not as much as I'd like. The crystal can appear a little murky, especially in low light conditions. And although the polishing looks fantastic, I'd have liked to have seen a brushed surface on the case of the watch, just to really punch home how great that polishing really is. There's nothing for that polishing to really contrast with. Now for the most important spec of them all. The price. As stated in the title, this Wise Adamascus AD8 can be picked up for $500. However, the retail price for this watch is $599. But signing up to the website newsletter will get you 20% off. So definitely do that. This will get the watch down to $479, which is an extremely competitive price for what this Wise watch is offering. I've reviewed what seems like hundreds of watches this year, and this Wise Adamascus is definitely in the top five. It genuinely feels like this this is the watch that Rolex would make if they had to make a $500 Submariner. The movement is fantastic, the attention to detail is top tier, and the overall look is pure class. You'll find a link to the Wise website down in the description, and if you feel like treating yourself then go and check it out. However, if your thirst still isn't quenched, then go and watch my video here where I rank 20 different affordable watch brands, and I'll see you over there.